Hello everybody, welcome back to the world of me. My name's Cougar and this is another episode from the Amazon Review Series. Got another package in today, as you saw from the title, another bike light. Let's open it up and see what's inside. So straight out of the box, we've got three different components right here. We have this piece right here and uh, we'll open that in a second. We've got this one right here. Let's go ahead and take the parts out of here. Obviously, first thing we've got is the charging cable. This is a USB-C. So we've got a USB-C charging cable. We have a uh, mounting strap. So an elastic one there. We've got some uh, different openings there, so probably for tension. And then we've got the rear light on off button there. And then you've got uh, the charging port there on the back. And that is for connection there. Let's go ahead and see what it looks like. So you got flashing, solid on, low. Well, I guess that other one was medium and this is low. And then a bright flashing, quick flashing and solid flashing. And then you've got the solid on again. Hold it and turns off. So no big deal there. Now the way this is set up, it's set up to go vertically. So when we go to do this, it goes this way. So we feed it down through this way. This piece sits in there and it's concave as you can see. So it's radiused. Then you swing that around the tube and you latch it on roughly like so. Let's try to get it over the thing there. There we go. So there we go. And then it would sit vertical rather than horizontal. So there we go there. Uh, the next thing we've got is this right here. And this is, well, a few more pieces. We've actually got, well, it comes with that right there. And that's the actual light. So we've got two little lights there. It has, of course, the charging port and the power button. And then again, you have a USB-C cable. So you can charge them both at the same time as long as you have USBs available. I will go ahead and put this together a little bit. There we go. And we can try it out here. So we've got uh, on, and brighter, and then a little bit less bright, and even less so. So you've got three brightnesses. Pretty bright there, just for two little LEDs. We'll check this out on the bike here in just a little bit. And then we just hold it, and the light goes off. Now, the nice thing about this kit... Um, is that it also comes with a pocket flashlight. Uh, now, obviously, it comes with its own charging, and this one is a USB-B micro. So you can see the little tab things right there, little hooky type things. Um, those are for pressure to hold it in, of course. But uh, so we've got that, so that's what this will use. But the advantage of this is you don't have to pull the bike uh, the light off of the bike in case you're riding at night and then you have say you have to fix the tire or you know maybe the chain kicked off or something like that you've got something else first thing we've got a belt clip so that makes it convenient we've got there for the charging port and then we've got the light itself as you can see it will extend out so we've got a zoom function and then we also have a side light so if we click it once, oh, we probably have to take the little thing off of the battery. Let's see, so this uses one of the 18650 style battery. There we go. So uh, yeah, so the battery was of course wrapped. So now we just drop it in there and of course, these 18650s, these ones, they do have the little nipple on them. Um, but that does have a spring down there at the end. So if you get the flat ones, if you have to get a replacement, that's no big deal. So screw this back in. Now, of course, this is made of aluminum. Both of the uh, headlight and the taillight pieces here are uh, both plastic. So you know about that. Uh, but let's see. Now we've got it. And hit the... There we go, that should be bright, lower, 
then we've got the side light flashing oh it's the SOS signal and then off so high low solid on and flashing so there we go now um, I'm gonna take these put them out on the bike and we're gonna check it out all right guys so we're outside and here's the bike you can see the tail light there and uh, we'll go ahead and flip through the side there are the brightnesses so there's the lower and there's the very low very low it does show up very brightly on the screen um, as you can see on my hand it is not as bright and uh, so I think that that is going to be a little bit dim uh, I would definitely suggest having it on high or flashing uh, there so um, and again, it's still not quite as bright as that in real life. Uh, as you can see, that is the high on the light there. And it's just shining out. And uh, I have it pretty close because uh, it is a pretty small light. And uh, if we sit here and change it, there's the dim. And that's really pretty dark uh, compared to the other one. Now it's still a little bit daylight out in the in if it's very dark out it's probably going to show up much better um, and i also do have a little bit of a street light off here to the side so it's going to wash it out a bit but uh and then we've got the real low which what you see on the screen might be what it looks like if it was like pitch black out but where i'm looking um basically i can barely see it on the sidewalk but there we go back up to bright and then from this, we've also got the flashlight again. Uh, so if we hit the flashlight, we have it on high. Uh, well, you can see it lights it up pretty good. Now, as it's open like this, that little beam right there is definitely much uh, brighter. Uh, if I focus it down, you can see this then becomes much brighter. Um, so, of course, with that... Um, there we go. You can see that that's a little better representation there. But uh, as you zoom out, it does cover again. This is just the flashlight. Uh, you hit it again. It's definitely darker. And even there, um, that's where this other light can actually outperform it. As I'm looking at it, it's actually a little bit brighter than the flashlight. And then the last one is going to be the side light. And the side light is pretty nice because as you can see it is lighting up the area very nicely and it is basically what you're seeing on the screen should be roughly about the same as what i'm seeing in real life so it's lighting it up very well so like i said if you have to work on the tire if you have to do anything to the chain or anything like that this little side light is going to work great and then again we've got the flashing there and that is the sos uh, flashing morse code uh, but there we go. Yeah. If you want to check this out, though, you can go down there in the description below. Of course, there is going to be a link to this on the Amazon site as well. Don't forget to check out the social media. Uh, there's the PayPal link to help out the channel. And uh, yeah, otherwise, that'll do it for me, guys. My name's Cougar. This is The World of Me, another episode of the Amazon Review Series. I'd like to uh, wish you all a good day, and I will see you later. Bye.